Me was growing up in uh, the 60s and 70s uh, with the women revolution, with the idea that I had, in a way, to hide the pleasure. Hide the of, pleasure. That probably was a mistake, the pleasure of fashion, because fashion was considered completely off limits. But I always like to express my ideas in a more subtle way. And um, so probably waist down was one of those ways. Ah, uh, not in my day. Mine was mm -hmm. the cafe society where women had to look their best sitting down. So we had to be bold from the waist up, mm -hmm. up with the shoulders, celebrate the bust. Hollywood fell in love with my silhouette. Catherine Hepburn, Joan Crawford, I made them embroidered jackets. With a lot of frills here, I would feel uncomfortable. For yourself or for women in general? Yes, I personally and in general. Instinctively, I refuse uh, the usual conviction that you have to be beautiful We're from the using convention. Up. But besides like that, it. so many things happening from waist down. Um, sex. Oh, you mean sexy stuff. Uh, sexy stuff, giving birth, being attached to the earth. And so um, it's really what makes life uh, uh, important. And the top part is more a decoration. And also because I'm against the idea of pleasing. Oh, no. I do, I... That I don't want to, to make women no, no, pleasing in an easy way. No, no, you can't say that there was anything easy about my hats. Oh, lamb chops on the head. I mean, it's crazy. But eh? craziness <laughs> in a shoe is such a weird place. You can have much more freedom. You can exaggerate. And doesn't feel to me stupid. Well, well, While if you put that. too much stuff probably but near your anyway. face, probably it's, it's, it's strange. Or at, at least it, it, or at least I'm like this. Maybe I'm just not able. <laughs>